it was this one female I knew, man. When I turned like, like it was in the mid nineties or stuff. I can't remember what age, but she was like five, six years older than me. Her name was Dana McGuana Payne. She followed me on Instagram. I mean, on Facebook right now. I don't know if she followed me on Instagram, but I know she followed me on Facebook, man. McGuana Payne. I used to be like, you know what I'm saying? I used to like her black ass, you know what I'm saying? She was a hustling motherfucker. She always used to be out there on the block and shit, you know what I'm saying? Like when I started hustling over there, she used to, over there Indigo Falls, West Minnesota. She used to always, she wanted a female that was out there on the block, you know what I'm saying, hustling. But she was a little cute little black ass motherfucker, you know what I'm saying? But I, but she was older than me. So, you know, I was I was a little young trick, nigga. I used to go over there, you know what I'm saying, take her goddamn dime sex every fucking day, you know what I'm saying? I'm talking about every day I used to take her dime sex and shit so we can smoke just to chill with her motherfucking ass. You know what I'm saying? Like one day, shit, she had me over there late at night, nigga, massaging her fucking back and shit, nigga, you know what I'm saying? Just teasing a nigga. I'm talking about just teasing a young, young nigga like I'm about like 15, 16 years old. She teasing a nigga. So, you know, one day we out, we all out there on the block, nigga. This bitch used to be packed, man. This Indigo Files, man. This bitch used to be jumping, man. So we all out there on the block. Huh, and one of our homeboys at the time, man, nigga name was Big Money. They get into it. They go to arguing back and forth, man. I can't remember what Big Money said, but Dana, she the type of female that always try to hit a nigga underneath the belt. You know what I'm saying? Like if she came, if she got ammunition on your ass, nigga, she gonna rock you with it. You know what I'm saying? I'm talking about she gonna hit a nigga. So I don't know what Big Money said, you know what I'm saying, to her. When, um, so she just snapped. Nigga, that's why you ate my pussy. She got a loud ass voice. And I'm talking about nigga, this motherfucker echo through the whole. That's why you ate my pussy when I had a yeast infection cream on it. I'm talking about the whole motherfucker. We all just got quiet. We say, what you say? I said, that's why he ate my goddamn pussy when I had yeast infection cream on it. I'm telling we all just went to laughing at money, motherfucking ass, like, ooh, money. He denying that shit, like, no, I didn't. But I know damn well, Dana, you know what I'm saying? She for real like a motherfucker. She like like a nigga out there. Like, she serious, nigga, you know what I'm saying? Like, um, so, like, throughout the day or whatever, man, you know, we went to rolling up sweets and shit, man. So I'm hitting that motherfucker. I, um, big money thinking he finna get that motherfucker, man. So I try and pass that bitch. Oh, he talking about, little Tony, nigga, let me hit your sweet. I say, hell no, nah, nigga, your mom got a vernacular disease, nigga. <laughs>